One of the primary issues in artificial lift is handling the solids during production. During a shutdown, sand in the production stream falls back into the pump and creates a solid plug in the pump. This can cause a failure when turned back on. This failure is costly to operators. Operators need a solution to be able to backspin the pump and treat through the pump with chemicals from the surface. The purpose of the sand lift is not to stop sand above the pump, but to regulate the rate of sand going back into the pump when the pump is shut down. Reducing plugging and allowing for chemical treatment from the surface through the pump. The SP pump turns on the differential pressure created by the pump pushes the dart sand breaker off of the open landing pad to the top position. Fluid and entrained solids flow through the tubular ports in one flow path to the surface. When the pump is turned off, the dart sandbreaker falls back to the open landing pad. Fluid and entrained solids begin to flow back through the tubular ports following the same path. The dart sandbreaker and tubular ports regulate the rate of sand that comes back through the pump. Because the sand lift has no seal, it provides the operator with the ability to chemically treat through the pump from the surface and use the backspin to clear obstructions from the pump. When the ESP pump is turned back on, the centrifugal force of the ESP creates turbulence, which lifts the fluid and entrained solids up through the tubular ports to the surface. 